Is this your first time? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Same. The most important thing is that you're around all the time. I don't have herpes, but it's okay with me if you do. So that wasn't so bad. I live a long, healthy life for that. What the hell was I doing in there? Oh, lighten up. It's about a woman late in life. It's been 20 years since her husband dies. She's really gotten used to being alone. Excuse <gasps> me? You seem, um... You thought I was dead. She does have her bridge group. She's got the gals. We are girlfriends. One of my favorite shows is girls. And here we are, older girls. Guys ask about you all the time, Karen. Don't start with a second husband talk. Couldn't pay me. But they do pay you uh when they die. I don't think that older characters are represented enough in film, so I wanted to do something unique and original and honest about people of that age range. You don't need all that. Just right the way you are. This romance sort of drops out of the sky. I want to have lunch with you. What's your name? Yes. Your name is Yes? I've been doing this nearly 50 years. Here was an opportunity again to play the kind of leading man character. Yes, I'll go to lunch with you. When? Now. Now? I'm hungry. She has a relationship with Sam Elliott. Because who wouldn't? I mean, come on. So you do this for all the girls? I took one look at my retirement, and I said, screw it. I'm moving to California, and I want a boat. <laughs> Is there something you'd like to share with the group, Carol? I don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> I love that she wasn't like an old lady. Do you still have any of that medical marijuana? People who are in our 60s, 70s, 80s, and even some in their 90s, are not like little old people. All right, all right, let's get this going. It's a very true look. It doesn't give you molly coddling older people. We're still pretty vibrant. For casting, there was something kind of magical about the way that these people came together. Working with June Squibb and Rita Perlman and Blythe, we just had so much fun. June, who shot to fame in Nebraska, even though she's been working all her life. I had made a list. Here's my first choice for every role. Everyone said yes. I've been a huge fan of Blythe for her entire career. Blythe Danner is incredible. I want her to adopt me. <laughs> I like you a little bit, I think. Always enjoyed working with a good-looking girl instead of working with some sweaty cowboy. There's not many Blythe Danners in the world. She brings a whole different level of subtlety and nuance and emotion and comedy. Brett created such a lovely piece. And it just was one of those little gifts. Now you say you're lonely. You're the best of what I had, you and Dad. This is an everyman tale. It's where all of us are going. You can't get through life unscathed, but life is also the most amazing thing. So where do you find that balance? People can spend their whole lives trying to find that feeling, and at the end, everybody gets it. I think it's sort of how to grow old gracefully. Cause I cried a river over you.